wonderful viewers. Welcome, welcome, and thank you so much for tuning back to my YouTube channel and uh, for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for your support. And if you are new here, Karibu Sana, please view these videos and other past videos. Share, like, and subscribe as well. And remember also, if you are new, to press on to that notification bell for all the upcoming videos. So guys, I'm happy again today to bring you a recipe, guys. And today we are going to make some porridge known as the warming porridge. First of all, thank you so much for those who watched the Uji strawberry who gave me the best feedback. I'm happy that you tried it on and you liked it. So guys, I want you today also to be keen and look at this, the warming porridge so that we can do it together. So guys, today I have this kind of flour. This flour is for making porridge. And the porridge that we are going to do guys today is the warming porridge, Uji Plus. I call it, okay, in Swahili we call porridge Uji. So in some cases I'll be referring to porridge as Uji. So when I talk of Uji Plus, this is porridge with extra, extra ingredients. So we are going to do the warming porridge. So guys, you know, all know about the meaning of the warming. We normally de warm ourselves. If I may ask, when did you last de warm yourself? plus your families so guys remember it's always advisable to de warm yourself after every three months or all kids to be de warmed after every three months but there's a tendency of people forgetting to do the de warming so guys i've just come up with this recipe on porridge which can also help you de warm and it is the best de warming porridge so guys this is so healthy kind of porridge so this flour or this porridge helps in the warming that is getting rid of infectious fungal and bacterial organism in our body so you know that's why we are always advised to to do the warming after every three months so here i have the flour and the flour is somehow unique you can see guys the color look at the color so the contents it it has some kind it has some mixer of maize millet and what has made the color be this is are the uh, papaya or popo extract the seeds of popo so the something extra or unique to this flour is the extract of popo or papaya so what it contains the flour contains some kind of proteins it contains fats fibers iron zinc and various um, vitamins essential like vitamin a vitamin b1 b2 b3 and all that so guys we are just going to do this kind of recipe that is porridge and i will later show you its benefit so we'll just start by cold water guys to the floor you, when you are making it, you just make it just like any other porridge. So guys, you can see here, the color. It's, it's unlike the strawberry one, which was looking somehow attractive with the, that amazing pink color. Today, our dove is black. See, this is a content of um, maize. Millet, as you know, the color of millet is also millet is also colored. And now, what is making it is even more more dark is the extract of of the purple papaya. That is the papaya seeds. So, guys, you make sure you mix it well until it gets smooth. And remember to use cold water when you are mixing it fast. So after that, guys, we are not going to ferment it. We are just going to cook it just direct the way it is. So the next step guys now is to boil some water and let the water boil. For those who do not know how to make porridge, 
you have you must have some water that will be adding simultaneously to your porridge so that it, when it gets thicker so guys my water has just bubbled my bubble water has just bubbled so i'm just going to pour in my duff and make sure you stir continuously for those who do not know how to make porridge you just stir continuously until it gets thicker you stir as you check the texture to see so i still have some remaining dab i just pour in everything so if you stop stirring it you'll end up creating some lumps so you should stir continuously to avoid lumps you see guys it's getting thicker the more it's heating the more it gets thicker so when it gets thicker you add some water simultaneously so guys i've just added some water and the texture is just okay so i'll just give it time to bubble and make sure you don't go far just be, get be standby as you check because the more it heats the more thicker it becomes see the porridge is bubbling now we just give it about five minutes to cook now guys this is the point now you can add in some sugar for a taste so you can either add the sugar it's, it's advisable to add sugar while it's still cooking so that the sugar can dissolve well into the porridge but at the same time it's not really necessary for some people do not take sugar so you can they can serve sugar individually aside but now that will be an option for you so guys the porridge is doing well now i'll just give it about two minutes to bubble well 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 so guys from here now you can see the color it's quite different from the strawberry one and i'll just remind you again the color is just because of the millet and the papaya seeds so to make it more tastier you can either have it like this without sugar you can have it add some sugar to it or any some any souring agent like lemon so that it can be more tastier but if you like this is just okay i think i'm just going to alert you about the benefits of this porridge from the content it has several benefits and guys i would wish you to try it out this is the best healthy porridge and in fact we are going back to our traditional way of making porridge because this kasamao it's traditional because it's uh, uh, natural the ingredients are natural so the benefits of this one is that the main one reason is that it deworms which means it fights skin infectious diseases such as ringworms mashilingi parents who have kids with mashilingi this is the best porridge for you ringworms so it fights infectious diseases such as ringworms two secondly it reduces worms infectious such as round worms and hook worms that's we say that's why we say it's before the warming three it's highly nutri nutritive since it has proteins fats fibers iron zinc four it also increases hemoglobin level since it contains some sort of iron and lastly it gives energy so guys this is a healthy recipe please try it out so guys my porridge is just ready i'm just going to serve it so this is now the right thing that you can just add some sugar put it to have some taste okay, so guys this
this is the flour for the warming you can get them from local supermarkets this is a pack a pack of one kg it goes for 250 kenya shillings so if you want to have at least one uh, just uh, comment down there and leave my contact there i will direct you but you can also check on from supermarkets you can have it mm -hmm.